you back in. <laughs> K Mac, how are you doing, bro? I'm good. I'm good. First time caller, by the way. Um, yeah, I see. I see. I love in uh, the background, by the way. I checked you out on um, with you saying recently that was hilarious. Oh, bless you, man. Um, uh, some something you just touched on before. Um, mm. obviously, when you're waiting for ages, you've got loads of things you're thinking about. But yeah. then we listen to your show, and then you're thinking about what you just talked about. Yeah, a lot of players spend a lot of their money on charities. Okay. And tax. Yeah. Where does the tax go? The tax goes to the country. And the money that they spend on charities is insane. Like Ronaldo spends like 30% of his wages in UNICEF. Yeah. You know, we seem to forget, we seem to forget that he do a lot besides yeah. just play football. You know, Canate's in Bahrain, like doing some kind of charity work on his on his holidays. You know what I mean? It, 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 you know, people don't really think of that because they just see them on the pitch and then and they see their Instagram post where they're sat on a plane and stuff like that, you know. But a lot yeah. of players aren't like that. I mean, Kante is probably, I think he drives a mini, doesn't he? You know what I mean? Mm. He, he can be paid a hundred, he can pay, be paid a hundred million, I don't care. You know, I don't mind I don't mind them paying Sadio Mane a hundred million because guess where it's going? It's going to his village. <laughs> Yeah. So you know, it's it's that side of the game that we should, that we don't see. Um, Although just, apparently um, Kante is actually tax free, Matt. Even I'm better, honest. let him eat that uh, bread. No, no, no so I'm just let saying him. that's a hundred mil tax free. That's mad still. <laughs> let him buy. A, let him, let him buy a Lamborghini. I've I've got a really big shout for a DM by the way, uh, Cal. Okay. And no one's no one's even mentioned his name. What's wrong with Tyler Adams? I knew you were going to say the reason that. why Leeds went down because he got injured. <laughs> I, I, He's an absolute monster. An absolute monster. He's going to be cheap as chips because he's gone down. He's probably got um, a relegation clause in his contract because I know the other guy has Brandon Harrison. And mm. when was the last time we had a Yank? Like the money we get off Yanks, we've got Yank owners. Like, it's, it's a big shout. Brad Free, would it have been Brad Fried or would it? Would that have been the last time we had an American player? I think so. Um, in the first team, yeah. Oh, yeah, we had some kid, didn't some yeah, we? Kid did. didn't, I'm we, trying to remember um, his name. The reserves. Oh, what was his name? He was a striker, wasn't he? Oh, no, I think I he was a left back. I can't remember, I know. Anyway, but but yeah, I think Tyler Adams would be a brilliant player, and he he'd be quite cheap. He played DM, but for me, just Viva la France! Like, just keep on, just get all of the <laughs> under twenty one French players <laughs> into our team because they are just winners. Like, they are just monsters. Like, you know, get get the other Thoran brother. He's six foot four as well. He's on a free transfer. Like, oh, is he is he free? Yeah, okay. Yeah, sign him right up. <laughs> <laughs> was the other one, is he a forward? The other one, his brother. Yeah, yeah. left winger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a full he's a full French international as well, just like his brother now. Um, Manu Manu Kone. I mean, the thing the thing about the thing about those players that we're signing, they can play anywhere in midfield, just like what Klopp likes with his strikers. Anywhere in the attack, anywhere in midfield. And I genuinely feel like um, McAllister is Henderson's replacement. I really do. Like, he is a future captain. He is mm -hmm. a real leader. Like, honestly, like Argentina only started to kick on when he started playing in the Argentine team. When he, when he uh, started playing, I think it was like three years ago in the Copa America. And they won that when they put him in the team. And then he went to the World Cup. And they got beat the first game. He wasn't in it. Second game, I think, was a was a was just a, an easy, like a, a, a close game win. And then he went in, and then that was it. And he played left wing as well in some of those games. Um, so he's interchangeable. And I think he'd work really well in the diamonds. You know that diamond that everyone says that Klopp's going to play eventually, the one yeah. which he created for Dortmund. Um, mm. It might come to fruition next year. You just don't know. Could do. It could do, bro. You might speak to KG about Tyler Adams. I haven't watched enough of him to, to comment, but a few people have mentioned him. 
absolute monster. Like he's just a brilliant DM. Like he's the reason why Leeds went down because he got injured. He got injured, and then they just kept on shipping goals of goals. And and have you you know you watched you watched him in the World Cup. He was unbelievable in the World Cup. Yeah, he is good. He was good. And he's another German. He's another signing from Germany as well. By the way, they signed him from Germany. You know, we need to start hitting that market. There's some unbelievable the, players in the German Germany. market. Is it might be the biggest market right now. And our marquee yeah, signing is Dominic Zabalsai. He's our Do marquee signing. Him? Yeah, I reckon I reckon the Vieira is a red herring. And I reckon George Smacked is over there trying to shift Carvalho as as a part exchange with, with money for Dominic Savolsai. Twenty two and he's a, and he's a captain for their country. I'm out of here. <laughs> Big up, Big up Kate. great debut, man. Big up, man. Nah, appreciate, you again, man. Bro. appreciate that. Man. No problem, lads, no problem. Keep it up, big keep up, it up. Big up. We'll do, bro. up the Thank reds. You, Come on. Great debut there. <clears throat> Facts. Um, here's, here's one for you. 